Hi. Hello. <laughs> Look who we got here. Hi guys. Oh. Uh, I hope you're all doing well. And uh, we've got a couple of reprobates <laughs> in the background, if you can hear them. And uh, we are sat in Paul's hotel room. And what are we drinking today, Craig? We're drinking a beer that Paul's brought over from the United States of a maid Eureka. Um, I've got to start again. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi, guys, and Hello. welcome to another beer review. And uh, I'm joined today by Craig from Ken Beer Reviews. And uh, we've got some fucking arseholes in the background. Uh, by yeah, the name of Harry from Brimley's Beer Reviews. Mine and his. I'm Paul from Pierre Brini's. And James has just finished in the toilet. He's just finished in the shitter. So, um, yeah. So, uh, so, so on, on, on that note, bum note, um, <laughs> well, what are we drinking today? This is Mr. Boombastic. Tally Fantastic. Yes, yeah, CBS from Founders. But this is the, um, the American size bottle rather than the exported size, which is We've we've had in the UK and Canada. Um, <laughs> yeah, okay. Right, yeah. Fuck okay. it. We'll, we'll we'll carry on. We've had a few beers, of course. So, but yeah. Um, so three fifty-five mil bottles in the UK and Canada, and probably anywhere else in Europe. But yeah, <laughs> the American size bottle, <laughs> yeah. the the barrel aged version. <laughs> so anyway, we will us. carry on because that's what we do. My co-pilot is is crashing and burning. We didn't, we didn't so this is an imperial stout, stout brewed <laughs> with chocolate and coffee, aged in maple syrup, no less. Um, yeah, bourbon barrels, of course. So eleven point seven percent ABV. Yeah, it's got that um, Canadian uh, thing going on there. Here's the bottle cap. For anyone who's still <laughs> trying to watch. And how are you? <laughs> I'm very well, thank you. How are you, Greg? Not too bad. Um, shall we get a bottle opener? I think we should, Greg. Right. So we could get into this bit. Thanking Sean. <laughs> do, you want, do you want to um, be professional? Oh, and, uh, thank, you, God, thank, thank you, Harry. I'll do it then. Uh, we'll, we'll get there in the end. What a shit show. Oh, what a pour. It's a poor pour. <laughs> it is definitely a poor pour. Look at that. To the rim. I'm rimming. There you go. Right. You is rimming? From Rimmel, London. I'm into right. It. I'm going to fill this glass for the first time this evening. Thank you, Paul. Paul right. brought this over from America, so yeah. He, and again, a big thank you to uh, Paul for this one. So, yeah, th th there's plenty of uh, goodness there to go around. What have we got? What does it look uh, like to well, you? To me... Jet black. Yeah, that, that's pretty much jet black. It's got quite um, a thick consistency to it. From the nose, uh, from the, from the nose, pick it up from the. Uh, he's got appearance. a thick, he's got a thick nose, but yeah, oh, it actually so much chocolate. It actually had nose. quite a bit of um, head the way I poured it in yeah, this glass. I, anyway. I, I don't know if any. Head. I think it's, it's, to, it's to do with the glass, whatever. But um, um, it, it's to do with the quality of the pour. Yeah, well, <laughs> this was a this was a quality pour, and then I just I poured his. Um, yeah. yeah, Roma then. Yeah, but like, have you already said? It sounds like you're snoring. <laughs> oh, Stuart. Stuart's gone. He's on the train. You can hear him. But um. But no, seriously, this is the aroma is like this mega chocolate. I'm not getting much of that kind of maple syrup. You with me? Are you getting maple syrup? <laughs> 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 I 
My first review of Peter. <laughs> the last. They will get better. <laughs> but yeah, but what a beer. Yeah, it, it, it is a wonderful beer, Craig. <laughs> <laughs> shall, shall, we, shall we dive in? <laughs> if he actually can breathe. <laughs> Cheers. You could do that. Cheers. <laughs> What are you getting? Are you getting much? Um, I love cocoa. It's like a lot of baker's chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> what a shit chocolate. <laughs> no, but in fairness, it's, it's, it's really warming. But in, in a, not an un, unpleasant way. Oh, yeah, You're getting yeah. a bit of that alcohol. Yeah. yeah. Chocolate. Obviously that maple sweetness. What is maple syrup on that? Not too sure about that. Um, um, more of a brown sugar note, I think. Yeah, brown sugar. Uh, now that it's been in the bottle for a few months, but um, no, it's, it's kind of calmed down a bit. It's it's really quite smooth, actually. It's very easy drinking. Yeah. I mean, it's not it's not as intense as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> no. <laughs> not at all. <laughs> There's no what can he do? <laughs> there's, there's no intense characters. This, this people. It's, you know, it's just. Uh, oh, please don't. Do you want to start a game? <laughs> Every fucking laugh. Please don't. Laugh. And there's me carrying on. <laughs> Whatever. God. It is what it is. I can't be asked to do this again. It's a really not, not nice gonna... beer, that's all I can say oh, right now. It's on your channel anyway. Yeah, so. there's, there's no harshness. No, there's no harsh feelings. No. No. You get that side like cocoa powder. Mm -hmm. uh, flavour. And um, it's very, very gentle. <laughs> on the palate. On the palate? Yeah, on the palate. Uh, on the nose, it's very, very soft. <laughs> but um, on the flavour itself... <coughs> we hard later. It's very easy to drink. Um, CBS is a really nice beer, fundamentally. It's, to be honest with you, it's not what I was expecting. I was expecting a little bit more intenseness in the uh, maple syrup. Yeah, it, it, it's a really simple layer. It's there, here. but it's, it's not as intense. Yeah, if you want to be as there, it will be there. Yeah, we had a beer last night from um, Brewery de Keys, or Brewery de Keys, from um, obviously yeah. the Netherlands. Um, so it's kind of like I was trying to in my head trying to compare it to that and, and, and try and be for professional and uh, <laughs> it's like you've been framed reviews <laughs> this is going to go on the channel so whatever <laughs> Whatever, whatever, whatever. What even got going in the first place? Not even funny. Heroin. 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 Neville. I don't know. He's just got the giggles. Neville. <laughs> Why this bit? Oh my god! You, you, you need to continue, Craig. Oh sorry. really? Oh really? He's really trying. <laughs> Right, anyway, let's go. I'll have one more swig. I mean, it, it, it legitimately smells gorgeous. It's a really it's a, it's nice a world class beer. Smell beer. And when you taste it, it's world class. Mm -hmm. But I just want a little bit more of that maple syrup. Maybe a tiny bit more? No, quite a bit more for me. As, just as, just as to like smooth it out a little bit, because it, there's like I'm not a very getting, subtle harshness to it. Yeah, I'm not getting much of the bourbon, I'm not getting much of the maple, I'm getting a lot more kind of chocolate sweetness, that kind of thing. Um, 
As I said, we had, we had the brewery keys beer the other day, and <laughs> the barrel trouble. age. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, the, the the barrel age version, and I was getting a lot more maple <laughs> off that than I am yeah. this. I'd like to have done a side by side kind of thing with two very similar beers. It tells me to carry on, and then. Um, yeah, I, I would have liked to have done a side by side with this. Oh, oh, oh. oh my god, I'm so sorry. This is like worse. <laughs> this is worse much. than a Joe Terrio show. <laughs> oh my god, oh, I'm so sorry. He's sorry. <laughs> the CBS He's sorry. Is a really I'm enjoying nice, it. Uh, soothing. It is. Hey, for what it is, it's really quite easy drinking. It's 11.7%. <laughs> yeah. You never, you never <laughs> drinking never... a lot less than that. Oh, it's a, it's a crazy good beer. But, but yeah, it's, you don't only get all, you hear all the hype, and this is back the back end of 2017 when it yeah. first came out in the States and Canada, and then I've, we got it, I don't know, whatever it was, the beginning of... <laughs> is the end of January or something yeah, like that? We just got on the train. Um, yeah. They've just got on the train. I just really yeah. thought that it was going to be a little bit more. Yeah, the, 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 a little bit more complexity. To yeah, me yeah, overall, yeah. But yeah, yeah. To be honest, though, as it stands, it's one of those beers where <laughs> you'd probably enjoy more on your own as opposed to other people. Interactions. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but I mean, I've, 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 had, I've had a little swig of this before and. Forget it. Come on. Come on. Uh, yeah, 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 yes, Craig. There's, there's no one else in this room. No. Um, it, it, it's a good beer. It's a very good yeah, beer. It, it's it, very enjoyable. Yeah, but it's not quite what I was... No, it's, no, it's, it's not. So what would you give it for a rating? Let's get out of it. Um, if I was to give this... Uh, I'll give it a fucking hit myself with that. Uh, if I was to give this a rating out of ten, I would probably give it a seven and a half out of ten. Oh right, wow. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Overall, in, what the style or enjoyment? I don't know. It's like I think I've built it up too much. In, and when I get around to drinking yeah, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. it's like oh, it's just an imperial stout that's been aged in. Yeah, I mean, bottles. I think in the style, I think it's very good. It's like a nine. I mean, don't get me wrong. It, it, there's no faults at all with this beer. Yeah. In any way, shape, or form. But compared to what is available, and what we've probably um, had in the last few days or the week. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. That They're trying to do it on purpose, aren't they? <laughs> um, so, so yeah, I'll give it a nine. Um, in the style I'll give and a it an nine. Eight out of ten. Eight out of ten for enjoyment and eight out of ten for style. Because it, it is a classic it, style. It's an beer. amazing beer that yeah. I never thought would get to the UK yeah. and it has and then Paul brought this Exactly. This this one over, so again, yeah. thank you mate. Cheers. Um, really yeah. do appreciate it. Um so yes, so it's, it's, yeah, I said already, but nine in the style and nine for overall enjoyment for me. Um, I think it's it's not quite up to um, some KBS. Yeah, I mean, I would yeah. from from my experience, I've I enjoyed KBS a little bit more than this. Yeah, I, mean, I would. I won't like. I've had three different I've versions. Only the, I've only or, had the one or, or version in two thousand yeah. fifteen. Yeah, yeah. When I throw my phone on the fucking door, but <laughs> yeah, but that's just you. That's just me. But but it's kind of. It's probably at the, the upper end of the worst KBS I've ever had. Yeah. But I've had, I think I've had better KBS. Oh, yeah. Vintages um, than, than, than this. But then, you know, they're still very enjoyable. Oh, and it, I, it's it's a really lov- nice. It's a lovely beer. So if you ever get the chance to try For sure. the CBS, do it. Mm-hmm. Because it, it lives up to the expectations, yeah. but it's just not as good. As some people make out to be. Yeah, it's just there's lots of hype that goes with these beers, and this is probably overridden the um, the KBS by far now. Now that we can get the UK a relatively good price, like about seven pound. <laughs> yeah. Um, 
God knows what this bottle would be in the UK. Was it twenty five dollars for this bottle? Was it twenty five dollars you paid for this one? Uh, twenty six. Yeah. Twenty six. So, yeah. yeah. So you're probably looking at like yeah, twenty three quid for this bottle of beer. It's expensive, um, but it's, it's the one of them beers to share, especially in this size bottle. So this is a um, size bottle. Is this? So it's a 2017 release. Uh, uh, I can't even find it. It's probably. Is, 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 is this a bomber? Is this a yeah, I think that's a bomber. Yeah. No, that's a 750. 750. Right there, you go. So, but so yeah, um, and that that is that. If you can still get it wherever you are in the world, give it a try. Give it a def definitely give it a try. If you like your barrel aged beers, then if you haven't had it already. That's on you, as Joe would say. Yeah. And he's got his channel coming out on the 1st of April, so check that out. That's it. April Fools. Well, motherfuckers. Cheers. Yeah, eat my ass. No, I'm sorry. <laughs>